This pregame interview is powered by Reliant. Drew Doherty with a guy who's having a pretty darn good week. It's Tremont Smith. You play corner. You had an excellent week on special teams. The AFC special teams player of the week. Let's start right there. I'm guessing this has been a lot of fun and you'd heard, or you've heard from a lot of folks that you don't normally hear from, right? Right. It's yeah, crazy. Everybody's hitting me up, but got to love it though. Yeah. Uh, okay. You score that first touchdown and that in and of itself probably wins you the award. But on top of that, you down a punt at the four yard line and the defense responds with a three and out and really kind of helps seal the game. You also start the second half by dropping Jadon Mickens at the 14 yard line. Big play there as well. And then on your second kickoff return, I mean, you did some damage. You punished some guys and you bring the ball out to the 33. You and that performance, it was really kind of encapsulating of everything you guys did across the board special teams. Why you said it was a near perfect game. What was it like being kind of the tip of the spear on, on that regard? Uh, it was fun. You know, anything, anytime I can go out there and perform for my teammates, I'm, I'm willing to do so, whatever, whether it's a gunner rep. If I got to go in as a reserve at corner, kickoff return, just anything, I'm willing to do anything to help the team. So I feel like I showed that this past Sunday and willing to show it on here on out. Yeah, how do you build on that individually? I know wins are the, the main goal. and You guys you know, want to win every game you play, but on an individual basis, how do you build on this? What do you, what do you set as goals the rest of the way? Uh, Just, I mean, I would love to get back in the end zone, of course, and just, like I said, just anything I can do to help the team just – just perform well and win the games. That's that's all I, I, it comes down to to me. Yeah. And, you know, with all those heroics on special teams, you actually were out on the field on defense, made a tackle, part right. of a really good effort there. What do you guys need to do against a high-powered Chargers offense this week? We got to just keep – they got a good quarterback over there, a good, great young quarterback and a good receiving course. So we just got to keep the ball in front of us as a def, defense perspective. Special teams, we got to go out there and dominate. I feel like we have the upper hand on them on special teams. So – we go out there and win that phase, and they can jumpstart our offense and defense. Yeah, what separates Justin Herbert from other QBs you've seen this year? Um, I think his uh, deep ball. He has a, he has a good deep ball, and he has the receiver that go high pointed in within Keenan Allen and Mike Williams. So he he does a great job throwing the deep ball, and he he doesn't force he doesn't force things too much. He'll take his check down and trust his guys to make some plays. So we just got to keep the ball in front of us and make our tackles. The way you guys are playing now as a special teams unit. How much have y'all grown, you think, overall from maybe week one, week two in the early part of the season? Yeah, you know, we, we all are new. We all knew pieces out there. And we actually had a bunch of guys from the practice squad up on, on special team this past week. So, I mean, they still come to practice hard like they're the starters every, each and every week. So I, that's why we was just so confident going into that game. And I'm always confident in my blockers or whoever I'm running down there with kickoff or my opposite gunner, no matter what. So I just we have uh, faith in all these guys and we know we all can perform at a high level. Yeah, you just brought up an interesting point, and you did it after the game on Sunday, talking about some of those those young guys like VZ, Strahan. I mean, that's the first time they ever even suited up in an NFL game. Right. If they come out there and they do what they did, how impressive is that in its own right, you know, where we are in the season and, and what those guys are doing, those young guys? That's a great job to them. You know, just it showed coaches that they, they was ready the whole time and they just needed their opportunity. And when they got the opportunity, they performed really well. VZ got a couple offenses snap. 53 Connor, he was out there a lot too. So it was just good to see them uh, actually take that opportunity, uh, take advantage of their opportunity. All right, let's see how you're powering game day. It's a noon kickoff at NRG Stadium. So with that in mind, what time are you going to sleep at night? Uh, I'm sleep by. I'm in bed probably like 8:30, like right when we get done with means, like laying around. I will watch some football if some football on or something like that. But I try to be sleep by like 10, 10:30 for sure. Yeah, and then when do you wake up? When eight o'clock, eight o'clock. Yes, get so you get a sleep. good like nine, ten hours of sleep almost. Yeah, I huh? try to get all the sleep I can and <laughs> make sure my legs are well rested. There you go, there you go. And what do you eat before the game? Uh, two scrambled eggs with onions and peppers, a little guacamole on the side, French toast, strawberries, and then I have a little protein shake I drink in the morning. Okay, all Pretty right. Routine. Heard- that's every that's been for the past 15, 16 weeks as well. So. Oh, okay, so you know by now <laughs> something you, this year. That's that's how you started doing it, huh? Yes, uh huh. I'm pretty okay. routine when it comes down to my food. I like having certain things on the right on a certain day, so kind of kind of can say I'm picky. <laughs> Nothing wrong with that. You like what right. you like, you know. You like what get I prepared. like, exactly. All right. Finally, what are you listening to pregame musically? 
a, a whole lot of future, little dirt, and little baby. That's probably my top three right now. Those are the three, huh? Those are the three. Yes, sir. They can they get me going. They get me ready to run, go hit somebody. All that. <laughs> There you go. Sure. Well, we'd love to hear it. We're happy for you. Uh, last thing, we know you want a, a win uh, from Santa Claus, but what else would you like uh, for Christmas? Um, I, th- I think I want a new car. I think it's about time for a new car. So hopefully I can get this new car here soon. Good stuff. Well, we hope you're rolling uh, in the car that you like very, yeah. very soon, like you're talking Thank about. You. Tremont yes, Smith, thanks so much for the time. Best of luck against the Chargers. And we'll see you again very soon. Yes, sir. Thank you for having me. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to our channel and ring the bell to know when we post new content.